Hey guys, I got a 97 7810 power quad here, uh, just over 8,000 hours. I'm going to do a quick walk around here and kind of explain to you guys the whole backstory on this. Uh, we actually bought this from South Dakota. Uh, it actually had damage. It was rear-ended by a car. Uh, I was hitting the back left dual and actually broke that rear axle. And I'll take you guys around and show you. What we had to do is we replaced the, the whole axle. The housing was broke right there. So this is a new used rear axle we bolted on. Um, and obviously a new dual. Uh, that was the basically the only extent of the damage mechanically. Um, everything else back here is original and was fine. It was just clipped in this outside dual here. And when that happened, it shoved that these wheels. You know, they, they took out the fuel tank and the steps and the fender. So all this has been replaced. Um, you know, we got new steps on here. Uh, the framework is used, repainted. Uh, we did pick up a used fuel tank, um, put new fuel lines on, and we put that back together. Uh, the only piece that is original is uh, the step here. And there's a couple of the original scratches there, you can see. But uh, that's the only original piece on this side. Everything else has been replaced. Uh, actually, the cab was tweaked. So we got a new used cab frame. It was uh, stripped down. We transferred everything on the inside, the, the steering console, the seat is original, uh, shifting linkage and everything is original. We transferred that over, uh, did a whole new interior kit, brand new buddy seats. Uh, the fenders on both sides are brand new. All the glass is brand new. All the trim, trim work around the cab is brand new. The top, cab top is new. Uh, we even did new LED lights uh, on the top and on the cab there. The side panel was fine, um, but we decided with the new fenders and everything else being repainted, we just went ahead and repainted everything else so it all matched. Uh, didn't really need it. It was really in really good shape when we got it. Uh, it did have a 740 loader on it, uh, a classic with a grapple bucket, a self-leveling, which we do still have. So if you guys do want the loader, uh, we do still have it and the brush guard and the brackets. Otherwise it is, uh, it's got the joystick in there right now and the quick attach, um, where the quick connect hookups here with a third link, third attachment for that gravel bucket. So yeah, that's about, that's about it. Um, like I said, it's, it was in really, really good shape. We didn't do anything to it mechanically other than change the oils. Uh, it seems it runs really good. It seems to be a really good solid tractor. It's had three previous owners, all in South Dakota. And, uh, you know, you, we could tell when we got it, uh, it was it was well taken care of. Uh, we did replace the exhaust um, that goes up and around in front of the cab. So that is new. And, you know, we kind of did everything that you would want to do uh, while we had the cab off. Uh, we replaced a bunch of hydraulic lines underneath the cab. You know, they're starting to show a little bit of age, being a 97, starting to show a little bit of cracking, so we went ahead and replaced them. You know, we replaced all the loader hoses. You know, there's the your third function there. Got your three SCBs. get your your inside wheel weights and outers and one thing I will point out with uh, the, the new axle we got this one is slightly longer than the original but it was just uh, it was kind of hard to find one but we figured uh, you know that would work just fine rather than going with a shorter one Otherwise, you never know. Engine's really nice and clean. Uh, we did replace, uh, we replaced the radiator and the fan too. That was new. And you can tell this glass being brand new, it just is crystal clear. Brand new buddy seat. That is the original seat, it's a nice shape.
It is equipped with the Green Star hookup. Also went through the front end. Put new bushings in the steering cylinders. Actually, those are brand new steering cylinder cylinders. And uh, new seals on the front end. Replace the seals. They were leaking a little bit, so went ahead and replaced them. Tried to cover everything. Does it have the foot throttle? Get the road here. 